President Buhari, there's great interest in your thoughts on many issues, on investments in the North East, on the Continental Free Trade Agreement. Um, feel free to take your pick, but would you like to take the microphone and, and leave us with, with, with a final thought from you? I think it's probably already turned on. Well, uh, thank you very much for the observations. I will start with one on the North East. Um, uh, all, all the questions, I think, uh, uh, will reflect uh, about uh, Nigeria's preparedness uh, to accept investment and secure the confidence of those who are going to invest or those who are already there. Um, I believe uh, for those who are following us closely, they could recall uh, on the political um, campaign we conducted and uh, the success we scored was based on three things. First, securing the country, and in particular, the person who mentioned the Northeast, the so-called Boko Haram was, uh, occupying a large chunk of that part of the country, and they cause a lot of damage to the infrastructure, especially educational and health. And then the economy. We have uh, a very young population. Our population is estimated conservatively to be uh, 180 million. Uh, this is a conservative one. More than 60% of the population is below the age of, six, uh, of 30. Uh, a lot of them haven't been to school, and uh, they are claiming, uh, uh, you know, that Nigeria has been an oil-producing country, therefore uh, they should sit and do nothing and uh, get housing, health care, uh, education free. But let me tell you that um, uh, recently, my Minister of Education or for Information was constrained to answer a question when people accused the administration of doing nothing. He said, let Nigerians be reminded what position we were before May 2015, what condition we are now, and what we have achieved between then and now. And I think people were impressed with the answer. The security, we have done quite well. Um, economy, um, we have done very well, especially in agriculture, by providing soft loans, and the uh, guarantee is just uh, you have to belong to a certain locality, and you have got land, you don't have to go to the banks, you know, uh, and bring a physical collateral. So uh, I think a lot is being done. And, um, and on the security side, certainly, uh, both in the northeast and in the south-south, uh, there has been uh, a, an improvement on the security of the country. And this morning, before just I came here, I saw Shell group. They came and saw me they are preparing to invest $15 billion, you know, uh, in, in Nigeria. They came and broke the news to me.